the scene. I read this uh, this manga chapter. Yo, what's up, Tail Fam Nation? It's me, the Tail Mother here again. We're back with the finale of Oshinoko Season 2. I am for sure knowing the fact that there's going to be a Season 3 because it's a successful series. But um, yeah, anyway, we're here with the finale of Oshinoko Season 2. So yeah, let's just jump right into this. I mean, last episode was very dark. Ruby and Akane found out Goro's body, which is Aqua's previous uh, character or... <laughs> body but yeah anyway uh yeah ruby is not glad about that reunion i mean damn that title called reunion is kind of mm. <laughs> anyway here we go uh let's just jump right into this we cannot forget the comment of the week so here we go Patreon shoutout also goes to these lovely members over my patreon to get the full access full experience with the visual and audio and I am currently busy as it is because I am literally writing my thesis and I know for a fact that Sunday is the release date of Oshinoko. I just don't know the time. So whenever I do my research, I refreshed at 6 p.m. here in the Philippines. It didn't appear, so I had to refresh at uh, another hour. So I was like, yeah, I'll wait. And now it's 7.05 or, or 7.06, yeah. Let's just go. So yeah, anyway... Before we begin, please drop a like, comment, share, and subscribe to the post that is on the video. Without any further ado, please drop a like on the channel. Without any further ado, without further delay, let's get right into it. Last episode, Ruby eccentric episode and arc. I feel like they'll do a movie because based on what I heard from my friend, it's a short arc, so a movie would be good. But it's not really that good of an arc based on him, but yeah. いつからこう回しとてるせよりあなたが泣いと来てけないなにもかもささげてしまうでもいいあなたの愛たまらたらないかけたものばかりてめちゃないちめいてちめいてちめいてなあいめいてちめいてちめいてなあいせんてきせん
โอ้Well, at least you acknowledge that. <laughs> Wow. He's so honest about this. That's my girl, bro. <laughs> Man, here we go. I feel like I know what's coming because I know. Ran Akane. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh, I love these shots so far. Oh, yo. That really does seem sincere. However, oh, uh, no, brother. No, I know what's coming, bro. <laughs> I've, been, I've been spoiled. So I know what's coming. And I know the recent chapter, okay? So I know what happened to Aqua. <laughs> and his father. And Akane. <laughs> What? She can see? Bro. Crow girl. What do you mean? Yeah, you call her a girl? <laughs> Little girl? Yeah, I bet. Oh! <laughs> Get your crows out of here. <laughs>
got so bad. Yeah, that's the worst too, bro. We've been there during shooting, filming. Yeah. <laughs> I feel your pain. I know who the college student is. No, the other one. <laughs> yep. Don't know. Don't know. <laughs> Man. Crowgirl is such a tease every damn time, huh? <laughs> Our actors. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but in the end, we all know who's gonna go on top. Hi, Crow. Hmm. There you go. Pop off Ruby. Yeah, driven by revenge again. This time Ruby. Shit. Oh, the voice. Oh, shit. The dark star eyes. And it's both the eyes. Wow. Why is Memcha always drawn like that? Because <laughs> she's tired. Yeah, and online editing, yeah. Yeah, uh, online editing is the worst, brother. <laughs> mm. 
Ruby. Mm, I see, I see. Yeah, you you two are now officially a couple, but we'll soon. Yeah, ah, I know what's happening. Okay. Me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 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 <laughs> because of what you thought. In an upcoming movie. Interesting. Hmm. Is it an indie film? Hmm. Wow. Yeah. Sorry to break it to you, Kana, but yeah, uh-huh. Ha-ha. Ha. Bye. Ha-ha. Ha. Bye. <laughs> but you'll have your moment, Kana. <laughs> Listen, I'm not. I. Oh, her tears are swelling. Oh. Yeah, well, I know what happened in the manga, okay? I got spoiled in chapter 162, 161, 160, and every chapters that were recently leaked. Yes. So I know who is the final one. No, not yet. I'm glad I kind of caught on quick. I kind of is quick on the uptake here. Yeah. Semi right. <laughs> Still awake. <laughs> Whoa, 
that's dark. He'll appear. He will. Oh, okay. We're having... Is this a special ED? Music video ending? <laughs> Feel like it. Oh yeah, this is the new song. Good thing I didn't listen to it yet. Her eyes! Oh. Whoa. Yo, Ruby. You can see the changes. Because I feel like they shoot it on different times before the incident. Yeah. I love the changes. Yeah. See? See? Yeah. I love how they added the realism on the uh, the time. The time frame that they shot the uh, the scenes. Yeah. Yeah. That was before the incident. That one. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> mm. Okay, so the ending theme is still here. Mm. The 15 year lie. Wait. Yeah, they're setting it up. Mm -hmm. The movie arc. I knew it. There's going to be an ending credits. Okay. Ending uh, scene, rather. <laughs> Credit scene. I love this ending song, bro. And I'm glad this won on the uh, best ending theme poll or uh, award. Because it's well deserved. This song is so good. It's so unique too, you know. Mortata have I'm crying in my mind was sick. Oh, it's glitching. That wasn't in the previous right it's glitching whoa come back it up <laughs> top of wall it is not in the previous ending uh visuals Oh, that was in the last one. Maybe I didn't realize it. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hikaru. Oh! It's the scene! I read this uh, this manga chapter. Because my friend let me read it. Oh, my God. It's her. Oh, shit. That's her hair color and eye color. There's Kamiki Hikaru. Oh shit! Ah, oh, one more Miyano, bro. Well, that is it for Oshinoko season two. All right, we all know it's gonna get a season three or possibly a movie. But wait, you know what? I'm gonna check. Oh, 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 season three announced. Oh, oh, wait, hold on. Let me, uh, let me show it to you guys. Would you look at that?
Oh, nice. We got Crow Girl, Ruby. So season three. Okay, it's not a movie. Okay, okay. There's Kamiki Hikaru. Aqua and Akane. Oh, I love this. Okay, okay. Well, that confirms it. We now have a season three confirmation. And I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. <laughs> From a mile away, I... I said to myself, it's either going to be a movie or a season three. And it's a season three. All right. All right. I'll, I dig it. I dig it. Third. Okay. Third season uh, production confirmed. Uh, yeah. Visual released. Yeah. Kamiki Hikaru re released. Okay. They revealed the name. That's nice. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, shares, brother. Damn. Okay. They, uh. Damn, I can't believe they actually revealed the name. All right, that's... Wow. Anyway, the visual looked a bit more like the season two, but yeah, because it's not the season three things yet. But yeah, anyway, I will give Oshinoko season two... I'll use this key visual poster right here to, to my rating. <laughs> I'll give this a 10 out of 10 again because it delivered all of the creativity is in there. Uh, they released anime original scenes as well. I noticed that especially on Melt's uh, character, the uh, character growth, um, it's literally growth. The title is growth. And I love the fact that they uh, did. Uh, they did that. And at the same time, they gave a uh, special treatment towards Akane and Kana. You know, both have their ups and downs for adaptation wise because I saw beautiful uh, Akane arts and Akane scenes. However, some manga readers were disappointed that those were the only scenes that were adapted and are not as good as the manga. However, most of them were really uh, praising the Akane scenes as well. So uh, let let's not. You know, let's not uh, beat around the bush that uh, they butchered the scenes because they delivered still on some panels, okay? Same goes to Kana because some scenes were actually cut off for Kana. So it's the same treatment. They had no bias whatsoever. But from Akane's stand perspective, they can see that they have a special treatment towards Kana. However, as someone who is not super 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 biased towards Hakuna because I also love Kana I noticed that they cut off scenes from Ka for Kana as well so it's the same treatment however when it comes to animations I feel like uh, the animators were more biased on uh, Kana that's not <laughs> but we're, we'll not get there but yeah anyway I love season two it got what I wanted because we have way more scenes of Akane, and I love uh, the Akane scenes. Uh, the Tokyo Blade arc was really good. We got a lot of character developments there. And this final arc, even though it's short, we still get, or we still got more Akane scenes. And that's what I love, because I love Akane, like what I said before, okay? And um, Kana was a bit sidetracked for, for a little bit, you know? Even though she has her focus on the Tokyo Blade arc, she has her moments on uh, certain scenes where, especially when Akane shined or shown, um, Kana delivered way more. She's shown even brighter. And um, I think they actually delivered on what Kana is supposed to be. She's supposed to be the sun. And that is really, really beautiful. And yeah. Anyway... I love it. I love season two. The developments are crazy. This season is by far my favorite. But in terms of emotions, I feel like season one still is the best because it got me emotional on the Akane episode, the reality dating show, where she almost committed the S word. Yeah, that scene or that episode was by far still my favorite episode of all of Oshinoko because I didn't get spoiled in that scene. And Unlike Ice Death, I got spoiled. But unlike Akane's uh, reality dating show, I didn't get spoiled. So that is why that got me way more than Ice Death. Okay? So, yeah. 
Anyway, season three has been confirmed, and yeah, I'm glad because it's uh, it's gonna be good. However, my friend did say that the arc has downgraded. So yeah, but we'll see though. We'll see. Um, however, like I said, I'm gonna read the manga, but we'll see if I can actually read the manga ahead because I'm gonna be busy on theses. So it's gonna be take it's gonna take a while, but yeah. We'll see which comes first. I graduate or season three? <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you guys on season three of Oshinoko. Peace out.